I guess my camera didn't feel like uh, hearing, hey there people. Well, hey there people. Woke up to some stuff in my driveway. I like that, mysterious scrap. Neighbor Mike threw some over from next door. More stuff from Neighbor Mike's. And some oddball junk. Well, anyway, a friend of mine called me. She's got a riding lawnmower for me. So we're gonna go get that. I still have this computer thing. Don't know what I'm gonna do with that. Probably nothing. I mean, it's probably it probably weighs 200 pounds, 250 pounds maybe. Oh yeah, more goodies from Neighbor Mike. Well, look at what I found. Some fridge uh, sheet music. What song is that? Whispering Hope. Oh, this. Oh, it's for the accordion. Right on. I always wanted to learn how to play the accordion, so there I go. And I just got a scrap pick an accordion. Wow. Some old shit right there, buds. Well, there it is. She says it runs, it just needs a gas tank. Anyway, I gotta get that unloaded. I got a few other calls to, to do, so let's get that off of there. There we go. Well, anyway, maybe I'll play with it this weekend, see if I can get it started. Obviously, it won't have a battery in it. I think I have a spare tank for it, I'm not sure. Well, change of plans. Those appliances I was supposed to pick up, they're gone. They decided to take it to the scrapyard themselves. Anyway, Dave asked me to do him a favor. He's got some rotten logs he wants picked up, but I don't know. And some compost stuff, so we'll go do that. Well, there's my scrap load for today. Oh no, that's not scrap. What are you doing with that, bud? Making mushrooms. So we're gonna have a whole whack of magic mushrooms. Well, now that I have Dave's uh, composting shit uh, delivered, I decided to uh, get some stuff together and put some shit together for a load tomorrow. Okay, well, so far it doesn't look like much, but it's really jam-packed in there. Like, all those pots are full of shit, like nuts and bolts and whatnot. That steel box is full of stuff. Well, I'm pretty sure I have enough to fill the truck up anyway, so... I'm just gonna pull this uh, compressor out of here. Grab that little coppers. Of course, the boss has to check it right out, eh? Well, I think I'm gonna call it quits from here. Um, I got a call about a washer and dryer, maybe. I don't know where they are. So I got to call them back, and if it's on the way to the scrapyard, well, I'll save room for a washer and dryer. If not, I'll finish loading tomorrow. I just can't get enough of having a fire. This is great. Crazy bastard. Looks like Dave's having a fire too. Maybe we'll go crash that later. What's he making up there, looker? The hell? For sure he's making liquor on the fire. Track. 
Good job, Randy. Well, it's the next day. Um, I have a washer and dryer to pick up, but it's uh, nowhere near the scrapyard, so I'll just return this shit. Two car batteries in there. It's tight in there. Should be a couple bucks anyway. All right, let's go. Well, I know I'm gonna get at least 10 bucks because of those two car batteries. At least 10 bucks. Well, I got rid of the two batteries. Now I'm gonna empty this out. I weighed in at 5,400 pounds. I weighed out at 48.40. 64 bucks. And I decided to keep this thing. Like, uh, there's three batteries in it and they give you five bucks a battery, so instead of just scrapping it all, so I'll pull the batteries out and get five bucks a piece. Well, now I get to go uh, flower shopping with Shelly. Um, if I have to go, you guys are coming with me. Here we are. Yay. This place is huge. I gotta find the herb section for sure. I found a kitty cat. Three hours later. I felt like that. Well, she planted some, and I manicured my beautiful lawn. Look how huge that is. Yeah, she's doing good. Ah, oh, there's even some up there. Looks like I'm barbecuing tonight. So what we have here is uh, this and that and the other thing. Salt, pepper, butter, and a little beer. Ah, I'll well empty the can. Need a cold one anyway. Okay, I'll wrap that in tin foil and let that cook for a while. And there's the meat. Oh yeah. Looking kinda good. But it's looking kinda good. Kinda, oh yeah. Couple more minutes, probably. Show you hard at work. Hey, nice shirt there. Thank you. Is that, that's my shirt. Uh, duh. Yeah, you put my shirt to get dirty on with okay. shit. Oh. Well. I put your shirt on to get dirty on. Yeah. To get dirty on. Yeah, dirty girl. You wore my shirt. So I guess these are going in the back on the deck. I guess I don't know. That's a nice one. You like it? Yeah. Well, I went with this bluish color here, and like a darker kind of pinkish purple. Then this one's white and purple. So there's two of each, and then just the middle. So. You liking that, Cash Man? <laughs> <laughs> this dog just loves water. It's hilarious. <laughs> He's a freak. Picture perfect. Would you look at that? Well, now that supper is ready, I have to load the boat. Because somebody, last time he was at the ice hut, forgot to cash his harness. He needs that for tomorrow. He's got the obedience class, so he really needs it. Anyway, we're going to load this up and uh, head out tomorrow morning to the ice hut and hang out maybe for a couple hours and come back and then we're done. Well, there we go. Well, this time I'm bringing a rope to uh, tie it off at shore. I don't want to lose it again. I don't think Shelly's a good kayaker. Or maybe she is. Maybe we'll test her. We'll kick the boat out and see. No, just joking. 
Well, right on, people. Well, I guess I'll see you in the lake tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Appreciate it. Cheers. And we'll talk to you guys later.